cutting my hair is, Ellie, how do you curl your hair? So this morning, I'm gonna give you guys a hair tutorial. So go shampoo and condition your hair. All right, after you get out of the shower, make sure your baby is still asleep. Make sure the two kids are not running around the house destroying it like crazy, which they are, and that's kind of why I'm able to film. <laughs> Just kidding, they're watching a movie. We're all happy, we're all good. I've washed and dried my hair, and the biggest thing that I've been doing for my hair is after I shower, is instead of just blow drying it or letting it air dry, I've been diffusing it. I have a lot of fine hair. A lot of times people, especially with very, very fine hair, they don't like to diffuse their hair because their hair isn't naturally curly or it doesn't help at all with the curls. I like diffusing my short hair because it gives me body, I'm not necessarily looking for it to curl my hair. So totally try a diffuser out, totally do it. When I diffuse my hair, a lot of times people will put stuff in their hair to help their hair curl. I'm not looking to make my hair any curlier than it is. I am looking to just give myself body and hydration. So I put some mousse in my hair. This is a humidity resistant super skinny serum. It's from Paul Mitchell. I've used this for years. I put that on the ends of my hair because it helps moisturize it. And so the diffuser doesn't necessarily, it's not necessarily going to curl my hair. It's just going to give the body, like I already said, a bajillion times. If I do want to like have my hair a little more curly, um, I'll, oftentimes I'll do small talk and this is a thickifier that you can put in your hair and it really helps my hair curl better. But that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so I don't want my hair sopping wet for this. And um, that's why I had it in a towel. I'm gonna clean my ears out real quick. <laughs> is in my hair and so far I haven't combed my hair yet I just kind of like finger pieced it around so I'm gonna figure out which side I want to part my hair on lately when I curled my hair I have parted it on the opposite side that I normally curl on because that gives it the most body but I kind of don't I don't think I want to do that today if I decide to switch I will so I'm just gonna kind of lightly find a part and this is the tip that my sister suggested to me was she said when you curl your hair she said grab those front pieces and pull them down that way your hair is like like because my hair is pretty short and so i take these front pieces and it's almost like i'm just like pre-straightening them just those ends and then when i diffuse my hair i'm just not gonna like grab those ends i'm gonna grab mostly this top section and then these will kind of naturally dry because I mean they're pretty much already dry right there in the ends. So I'm just going to go through and I'm going to diffuse my hair. See and when I get to these ends in the front I just hold them down and I diffuse around them. Which one? Oof. You know just a slot fight between brothers is all. hair is dry I'm gonna go through and fill it make sure it's all dry can you see that these sides are much straighter because I've been pulling at them making sure that they're not super curled so that is if my hair diffused as you can see I really tried to leave this section alone because I don't want around my face to be like scrunchy curly I'm gonna end up curling a few pieces away from my head if I would have put like a mousse or something to really curl my hair I would have had more curly pieces but I didn't, I wanted mostly moisture, so that's why it's just kind of just volume. And the back is much curlier, and I love that. So just go through and make sure it's all dry. Um, I don't like to over dry it. Sometimes I'll just do it for a second and then let it finish air drying. I'm just gonna maybe do my makeup while it just kind of sits for a minute. Um, I wanna show you guys. So I have used um, the IT Cosmetics CC Cream for years. And I don't always love wearing a foundation, but I like wearing like some sort of cream. Um, but this I have a hard time because when I kiss my kids, it rubs off on the kids. Like it's very tacky. And then I started using the Clinique CC cream because my sister recommended it to me, which I do like and I've been using for a while. But this, this has been my favorite so far because it doesn't wipe off on the kids. It's the Pure Lease. 
I think is how you say it, BB Tinted Moisture Cream. This is the, what I've been wearing every day as my foundation and doesn't transfer the t to the kids. It's not tacky. It just gives me a little coverage and um, makes my complexion even. So I'm gonna put on a little bit of makeup and then I'll finish my hair. Oftentimes I will leave my hair like this because it looks just fine. Um, for the first day but if I curl it there are two curling irons that I like I've been using this curling iron for a little bit um, I don't even know what the brand is but I like this for the front pieces of my hair or if I want my hair really curly this is new to me my friend um, on, I found her on Instagram she's like I love her um, her name is Chloe Brown Chloe N Brown I believe is her username I'll have her linked if you guys want to look at her page but she does really cute tutorials on short hair but um, she loves the brand croc and so I ordered this one and I use this to curl some pieces of my hair so when I curl it I only curl like a few pieces back like four pieces around my face maybe a few in here I never curl here and I curl like two or three pieces in the back so I don't curl very many pieces so I'm just gonna start curling <laughs> So I literally only curl just a few pieces to give it something. Um, I'll either go in and just hairspray it or this is, um, I found through my friend Chloe Brown, it's ADH dry and it is like a pomade. Um, see, and you always do it, you always do too much. When you're trying to show people how to do your hair, you always put too much product in your hand. Um, I just go in and lightly just kind of scrunch it a little bit. This is a super, I, I would say it's a lightweight hold. It's matte, so it's not like oily or greasy. And I just go in and fluff my hair, and then I just spritz it a teeny bit with hairspray, and I'm done. I like this because my hair is not crunchy, curly. Like when I was in high school, I did like egg whites and diffused my hair, and it was like crunchy and curly. This is very airy. It's very lightweight. It's super fun for a date night. It's super fun if I go to the park with the kids. Um, and I usually do it really fast. Like, I can do it really quick. Um, and I often will even just wash my hair and diffuse it at night. And then when I wake up, just curl a few pieces that way. I'm not like, kids, sit and watch a show forever. Um, so yeah, that's it. Now I'm just gonna spritz it. Especially the front piece. I like to like get that away from my hair. And I like it big. Like, I want like volume and I like it big. Haven't even looked at the back yet. There it is for you guys. Yeah, and that's okay. Like I literally just don't mess with it. Like I'm happy with it. <laughs> it looks good. So that's how I've been curling my hair lately, guys. Jared and I took the weekend off. We have just been really spending time together, spending time with the kids. And so today he's catching up with editing. And so I have, what are these? Adventure hats for us. They are adventure hats. Put yours on. Calvin, come here. I have to you Here, on will you put adventure? this on? What is this, Calvin? Adventure hat. We are gonna go on an adventure. I have been wanting to go on a little hike with my kids outdoors. It is, we have one week left when you guys see this. One week left until it's October. My goal this month was to go on like four hikes. We have gone on zero. And so I'm feeling good today. Tommy's been happy and so today is the day. Look at me, Jax. <gasps> We're going on an adventure. Can you buckle the back clips? Can you see that? Can I buckle it? Yeah, will you squeeze it and buckle it? I can't reach. Ah, squeeze really tight and try hard. Try hard. How as you can. Does it hurt? No, it doesn't. But try and clip them. Oh, I can't. Oh, what was I thinking? I should have brought the other carrier. Got it. I have everything I need. The boys and I, where are you, mister? The boys and I drove up a beautiful canyon. We found an awesome spot to go on a fun adventure slash walk. I thought we could go to like Chick-fil-A and go to the park like we always do, or we could get out and go 
find a trail in our own backyard. And this, I love this. This is all I want to do. It was a little adventurous of me today, but I thought the boys would be good and it'll be just super fun with everyone. Calvin fell asleep though, so <laughs> well, we might just stay here until he's happy since he just fell asleep. Kids are not fun when they wake up. What were you gonna look for on our trail? Monsters and ghosts. And trolls. And trolls? If Whoa. I see them, I'm Wow, this is our trail, guys. Oh my goodness, this is beautiful. Calvin, are you doing okay? Do you have liquor in your teeth? Yeah, just big. I won't walk away. What do you want to look at? We're going to look at the pretty trees. And I won't walk away. Did you see enough trees? Okay, let's go. You have got to be kidding me. With this view, this is unbelievable. I cannot believe we're doing this. Something that I just have, that's been kind of like on my mind a lot is, I love camping. I love fishing. I love four wheeling. I love going on not crazy, making sure the baby can breathe in here. Not crazy intense hikes, but I can't, do all of that <laughs> like my mind wants to do so much but I know I can't and if I do it's just a lot harder just with the kids but stuff like this is easy because the kids want to go outside they want to go outdoors and they literally are just following a trail and I'm just following them they love picking up rocks they love looking at bugs that are flying by it's just so fun so I'm glad that this is what I decided to do for the day fix my hair and <laughs> go on a walk See, and they find sticks. It's the best. What lake is that? That is Bear Lake. Oh my goodness. I'm going to get your picture in front of it. <laughs> Come stand right here. I'll take your guys' picture. But one of the reasons why Jared and I bought our camper last year was not necessarily to go camping all the time right away, but so that we have it even if we take it out once or twice in the next like just few years as the kids are young and then as they're older just go all of the time. Well, something that I want to do in October is go somewhere with the kids with a camper because they love it and it's fun and it just gets you outside and I really like that. When winter comes I do get kind of winter blues. I absolutely love it because it's beautiful but it just lasts forever, so we gotta take advantage of the weather and outdoors while we can. I absolutely love the ocean. I've only been a handful of times. You guys saw the first time I ever went to an ocean. And before Jackson goes to kindergarten, my goal is to take all of us on one big trip to the ocean for like a week is what I'd love. And just sit on the ocean for a week. So in the next year, that's what I'd love to do. Um, but it's funny how so many people travel to go to different sceneries. I want to travel and go to the ocean. So many people travel to come see, I mean, this is dead view, but that view. Look at the beautiful green trees. The trees are changing colors for fall. This is unbelievable. What do you guys think? Amazing. It's amazing? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Stop talking, Mom. More walking. Jackson and Calvin think that's a treasure because it's an X. Another map. And these are the maps. <laughs> Tommy is enjoying the nice cool breeze. Oh, it's so funny. Why are you guys laughing? Because Tommy did a funny part. He went back. Like that. <laughs> that was so funny. Tommy. Time to eat. Time to poop. Time to sleep. Yes. He finally woke up and he had a huge old burp. Guys, he's getting so big. Look at those eyes. Are they gonna stay blue? <laughs> Are they gonna stay blue? Grandma Griffiths would say, no way. 
She's had too many babies with brown eyes. But we'll see. I think they're gonna stay blue. We'll see. Who took the best nap ever? Jackson, who took the best nap ever? Tommy. Tommy. Tommy's taking a nap and mama shut her eyes. We came home and I said, I'm laying down. <laughs> so we all laid down for a little bit. Um, the best fall snack, it is so good. Brownies are in the oven and cut up a bunch of apples, put just a teeny bit of butter on it, put a little bit of brown sugar, a little bit of nutmeg, a little bit of cinnamon, a little bit of cornstarch. Mix I that all together. Oh, you can mix it with that. And then and then drizzle over this. Put it in the oven with um, tin foil over it for like 15, 20 minutes. Pull it out and these are the yummiest soft apples that you could put in oatmeal, you could eat alone, or you could eat it with a hot, warm brownie. Ah, oh, so good. Lemon juice, that was what it was that I forgot. So after you do lemon juice, brown sugar, cinnamon, nutmeg, a little bit of cornstarch, put just a little bit of butter on your apples. Literally, yesterday I make it, made a big old plate, today I'm just making a little bowl. It's gonna be so yummy. I love when kids talk to themselves. Calvin, come inside now. Come on. And one of the most important steps that you need to take is to kiss your husband that you haven't seen all day long. Yeah. That's the important the step that one. you need to take is kiss your wife that you haven't seen all day long. We'll meet in the middle. Don't kiss. Don't kiss. She is my wife. No. That's my wife. Shh. You are going to wake up the baby. He needs to know that I will kiss my wife. That is not your wife. I'm <laughs> your wife. What? You are driving me crazy. Done. Enjoy. Peace. <gasps> Oh my goodness. Here is the final result. It's so good. I like the little caramel swirl that you did. That's a great idea. Scary jelly. Okay, come take a look, boys. And guess what? I'm not even gonna wait till it cools like the package says because I want it now. Okay. You know the whole party pooper situation? x -nay. You're a party pooper. I have, I have claimed the party pooper status. Oh no. Oh no indeed. Everybody Except you, you rock on and party all night. And every day. Okay, let's enjoy this together as a family. You guys ready for some of this? Thank you guys for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, give it a big thumbs up and we will see you next time. Bye!